First powered on in 1966, the T.B. Simon Power Plant delivers reliable and affordable electricity and steam for campus, powering Michigan State University's ability to advance knowledge and transform lives. Its electricity powers everything from your phone to the nuclear research done at the Facility for Rare Isotope Beams, and its steam heats most campus buildings during cold months and cools them during the warm ones. Since 1882, MSU has generated its own heat with the construction of the Boiler House on what is now North Campus. In 1894, the Boiler House was upgraded to generate electricity, allowing the first electrical lights at MSU and making the campus one of the first electrical microgrids in the United States. The T.B. Simon Power Plant first burned coal as a fuel, but in 2016, it switched completely to natural gas, a cleaner fuel that greatly reduced greenhouse gas emissions when compared to coal. The switch away from coal meant that in 2018, MSU had reduced its carbon dioxide emissions annually by 410 million pounds, equivalent to planting 500,000 trees. Here's how the MSU power plant works. First, underground pipes deliver clean burning natural gas to the plant. The gas then heats large boilers to generate steam. That highly pressurized steam turns the blades of turbines to create electricity and then is distributed to buildings across campus for heating and cooling. But the power plant isn't the whole story of how MSU generates power. As part of MSU's commitment to using more sustainable energy sources, power increasingly comes from renewable energy sources. MSU's campus hosts the largest solar array of its kind at five commuter parking lots. Solar panels mounted on parking carports provides about 5% of MSU's electrical needs as of 2019. The solar array covers 45 acres, or 5,000 parking spaces. They're expected to save MSU $10 million in electricity cost over two decades. In addition to solar panels, MSU turns farm manure and food waste into biogas, which is mostly methane, with an anaerobic digester. The biogas then powers an electrical generator converting it into electricity and heat for buildings on the south side of campus. For more than a century, MSU has provided for itself with the cutting-edge power and heat generation technology of the time, and will keep doing that into the next century. Dependable, affordable, sustainable. That's MSU's commitment to power generation on campus.